Welcome back to Living Local. A Taste of Ireland comes to Davenport's Adler Theatre on Friday, October 18th. And here to tell us all about it via Zoom is Julia O'Rourke from A Taste of Ireland, which is also this segment sponsor. Hey, Julia, welcome to the show. Hi, thank you so much for having me. It's a pleasure to be here. Yeah, absolutely. So let's talk, you know, let's start with the basics. You know, what is A Taste of Ireland? What's the show all about? A Taste of Ireland is a music and dance show um, that features lots of rhythmic and um, precise footwork uh, through Irish dancing and some of our best, some of the best musicians around the world. And um, we describe um, through music and dance the history of Ireland dating all the way back from the FINA to present day Ireland. And we um, go through some of the major events that happened in Ireland, such as the Vikings takeover, the, uh, the famine, the Easter rising, uh, hurling matches. And it's there's there's a lot of ups and downs in Irish history, and we kind mm -hmm. of go through all of it in just a short period of time. And it's a very enjoyable show to watch, and you can really learn a lot about the history of Ireland through it. Yeah, the videos are pretty rad, man. I, I watched some of your footage. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been with the show, and how long have you been kind of dancing? I've been um, Irish dancing since I was five years old, and oh, I'm wow. 25 now, so a long time. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and some of the other dancers on the troupe have also been dancing for 20-plus years. Um, and I started with The Taste of Ireland just last year um, when they made their debut into America, and I've been with them ever since. And that's, that's amazing, dude. Uh, so let's mm -hmm. talk about what people can expect when they come see the show. You kind of touched on it a little bit, but I'd like to dig into that a little bit more. Yeah, as I said, Ireland kind of has a really tumultuous history, so there's a lot of ups mm -hmm. and downs in, um, throughout, throughout Irish history. And so you can expect to be happy, and you can expect to be sad, and you can expect to be scared, and and have some happy tears and sad tears, and yeah. you'll really go through all of the emotions when you watch the show. Um, and we're very, we're a very interactive group of people, so we interact with the audience a lot. So uh, you can expect to try uh, get involved a little bit when we're dancing. Yeah. Do you have a favorite moment from the show that you like looking forward to every night? I do. There is one part um, right before we talk about, or right, right before we do the number on the famine and a bunch of the girls go out and we have basically like one last hurrah before the, the famine begins. And we just dance around the stage with, and it just with, with, with all the girls. And it's really fun. Like it, and then yeah. we start uh, uh, going into the famine. So it's the really high part of the show that goes into a really, really low part of the show. So there's a lot of emotions in just that short five minute span. Yeah, that's awesome, dude. And you know, most people, you know, they know Lord of the Dance, they know River Dance. Um, are, are some of the alumni from those shows involved in this show? Yes, there are quite a few uh, of our dancers and troop members currently that were a part of River Dance and Lord of the Dance. And also one of our producers, um, Kaylee Moore, she was one of the leads of Lord of the Dance um, quite a few years ago. And uh, now she's our producer, and so she has a really great history in show dancing, and she's one of the best inspirations to, uh, and role models to look at for us. That's awesome, dude. And, you know, it, it sounds like it's a show for all ages, and it kind of spans the emotions, as you said, but um, it looks like it's kind of a cross-generational thing. You can kind of bring the whole family, right? Yep, yep. Uh, all kids and even the elderly, anybody can enjoy the show, and I think you could take away something. You can really enjoy the music and the dance, and you can learn a lot about Irish history. Um, yeah, so the show is for all ages. I think anybody can enjoy it. That's awesome. And I know you're playing Davenport on Friday, and you're in across the state this, this month. But um, thanks so much for joining us, Julia. This was so cool to chat with you briefly and, uh, and, and break a leg with the rest of your tour. Thanks so much. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. Again, this segment was sponsored by A Taste of Ireland. You can learn more when you visit a taste of Ireland show.com. We'll have all those details posted at ourquadcities.com.